friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you some inexpensive gifts that I got from the Dollar Tree and ideas on how I incorporate them with our elf on the shelf. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, turn on the little notifications bell so you're notified whenever I post a new video. All right, so let's talk about cheap gifts for kids for Christmas. Now we do Elf on the Shelf for the 12 days of Christmas. We actually start like a week and a half or so before Christmas. I used to start the beginning of December, but doing it every day, it just got, first of all, time consuming and expensive. So we actually just do it now the 12 days of Christmas, 12 days leading up until Christmas. Our elf comes, we actually have two of them now, one for each of our kids, and our elves come and either bring some sort of a small little gift or a small little activity for them to do. Now Alyssa's getting older, she's a teenager, she's 17, so she's kind of, you know, at that point where she's not really you know, she still wants something, but she doesn't really want the little gifty type things that Jameson might like. So I try to find things for her on the cheap that are still like geared towards her age that she would like, but she still likes to do Elf on the Shelf. So I'm going to share that with you today. I'm actually going to share with you some of the things that I picked up from the Dollar Tree that are like gift ideas on the cheap that you can do for either your kids, your grandkids, um, like Secret Santas, any anyone really. And I found some really cute stuff at my Dollar Tree and Dollar General. I'm also going to show you some of the things that I ended up purchasing last year after the holidays at a huge discount. Now I highly recommend doing that after the holidays. Save up a little extra money. Go to Target Dollar Spot. Um, go to the stores that clearance out their Christmas stuff and pick up some things. Um, and I'm going to show you what I ended up finding. Um, and you can very often get them for like 70, 80, even 90% off and then store them away until the next year. Okay, so my family loves to bake. We love doing cookies. We love doing um, cakes. Jameson's birthday is actually in a few days and I'm actually going to make his cake at home. Alyssa's going to help me. So we love kind of doing that thing as a family. So this year I found a few things from Dollar Tree that I'm going to put together for a really cute little um, gift for Jameson because he's kind of at that age now where he's, he's almost four and he loves to help out in the kitchen and these things I found at Dollar Tree and they're like the perfect size for him and it makes a really cute little gift. So first of all, in the Dollar Tree, in the kitchen section, are these little kind of silicone um, kitchen utensils. It's called, it's the Cooking Concepts brand from Dollar Tree. They're all a dollar a piece, but they're smaller, they're perfect for his little hands, and they're like, silicone plastic so that way they're gonna be you know he'll be able to use them easily so there's a mixing spoon um, there's a little bowl scraper which is perfect there's a little spatula just perfect his size and a cute little whisk now they had a few others also but I only got four because I think these are the four that he'll use the most if we do baking together but how cute are these all in different colors from the dollar then I also wanted to find something to you know kind of put them in so I found just these little little plastic white bowls. There's a set of two and they're bigger than a regular cereal bowl but small enough where he can you know put a mix in and mix it himself you know with my help. So there's two of them so I thought that this would be like kind of a good base to put like some of the other things that I bought. I also found these fun Fetty sugar cookie mix which I liked the colors. I thought the colors worked really well with the colors from the little kitchen utensils. Um, and yeah, it's just a small packet so it will fit easily in this bowl for him to make. I think it only makes like a dozen sugar cookies. And then I also picked up the little fun Fetty vanilla frosting. And again, this is a smaller container so it will be perfect. We can frost the little cookies and you can put all of these inside the little bowl just like that and it makes a perfect little gift so this is something that our elves can leave like when they come they can leave it and both Jameson and Alyssa Alyssa can help him do this which she loves helping him cook and and baking together usually when she babysits she'll make cook cookies with him or she'll do something like that with him so this will be something fun for them to do and again really inexpensive less than ten dollars I think this was like what seven dollars this is something for Alyssa this is something that I'm probably gonna not leave her the whole thing um, but I'm thinking like 
piece by piece I can leave like one different thing every day for her and then at the end of the 12 days of Christmas they can kind of all add up together um, but I found this really cute basket and it's a really nice basket it's a metal basket with a little liner and these little gold handles this came from Dollar General it's actually part of their um, perfect harvest collection it was normally five dollars but all of Gen Dollar General's harvest collection or fall items right now are 50% off so this was only two dollars and fifty cents and again it's super sturdy this will be great for her to store bath products in so I wanted to definitely pick it up when I saw it so definitely check out your dollar generals um, and go to the section of their like leftover fall stuff and see if they have any of these if not I know um, dollar store also has some plastic bins like that that would work perfectly as well but I just thought this was kind of nice when I saw it and for two dollars and fifty cents I definitely wanted to grab One of the days for her I'll probably probably stick her elf like in this little basket and she'll be like okay why am I just getting a basket but then every day I'll have the elf bring something to add to the basket and then she'll be like okay I get it it's kind of like a spa kit. that was my whole idea for this gift for her now I found some really nice things from dollar store that will act as like spa type items and they have this line it's the bolero line from dollar store there's some nice like spa type items um, I picked up a paper facial mask this is the French lavender and citrus mask right here so that will be one item that will go in her little um, spa basket um, also they had the French lavender and citrus bath bombs now she's all about bath bombs I know we usually get her like a good assortment of like bath and body stuff and also um, bath bombs and stuff like that for her stocking at Christmas time um, but I think this will be fun you know leading up until Christmas and then this one is the facial wipes the um, French lavender and citrus facial wipes they had moisturizing lotions they had like shower gels and stuff like that also I saw these cute little fuzzy socks that I'm gonna stick in here as well um, 11 other gifts that will go in here and they'll all be like spa related gifts I'm thinking some nail polishes um, I'm thinking you know maybe some foot creams something like that At the end of the 12 days of Christmas she'll have this cute little spa set so that's another idea for a teenage girl and you know again it's on the cheap pretty inexpensive um, and it's something you can do for like a buck a day all right this is another little kind of gift gift type set that I got for Jameson again I got most I got all of the stuff from the Dollar Tree it's a themed set and it's something that he can do he's totally into dinosaurs right now so I actually got the idea when I saw these dinosaur stickers from Dollar Tree they're really nice they're the 3d stickers so they pop up really really nice quality like this is something that I would see at like Joanne fabric in their sticker section or Hobby Lobby but Dollar Tree you know you're stepping up your game with your like craft and sticker stuff so I I spotted these and I said you know what I've got to figure out something that I can do for Jameson as like a little art project that I can have his elf um, bring to him so I also bought one of these um, stretched canvas um, boards right here this is the larger of the ones that they had they had a few different sizes this is the 8 by 10 but I thought what a great idea if I could grab some paint which I grabbed some green paint from the dollar store. It's the Crafters Square green paint. I also grabbed some little paint brushes. And again, I'm keeping everything in that kind of green theme because there's a lot of green, green in the dinosaurs. So he can, you know, paint the canvas and then, you know, embellish it with stickers. And then I also got some of the green tinsel, which I thought would be really cute to like make these like little curly Q trees he can glue on in the background. And I also bought some of the washable kids glue. And then to store all of it, I found this cute little green container, which will be perfect to put all of the little items that I got him in. And this will be another cute idea that the elf can bring him and he can have fun making like a little dinosaur scene. And then he has something to save and we can date it and save it that, you know, this is what he made from the elf in 2019. I love doing like special candies for both of my kids, but especially Alyssa. She, you know, is into like more of like the high quality candies. Um, you know, she likes everything, but at Christmas time, I like to do something a little bit special for her. So I saw these from Dollar Tree. This is the first time I saw them and I was like, yes, I'm gonna make a stackable candy gift box for her. And they're these cute little books. They're all different like um, vintage style 
theme. They look like a little book. It's a vintage style Christmas scene, but it is actually a little box. So my plan was I actually bought three different sizes. There's a large one, there's a medium, and there is a small right there. And they're all these really cute vintage themed gift boxes. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go to my local candy store and they make like high-end um, chocolates and really like fun stuff for the holidays. I'm gonna get some of her favorite candies and I'm gonna put them in these little boxes and this is gonna be like a little gift from her elf this year. Again, she'll appreciate I'm gonna get some like nicer chocolates for her. And you know, it doesn't have to be a lot, but I thought it'd be cool to have something different in each box and then I'll put a little ribbon around it and it'll be just something fun and she can keep these and decorate her room with them after or use them for something in her room. So that's another really cute idea for like a teenager and that could be for a boy or a right girl. now, with the release of the new Toy Story movie. Jameson is all about Toy Story. He has been binge watching Toy Story. We've got the new Disney Plus and he loves it. Toy Story, Toy Story, Toy Story. Everything's Toy Story. We've watched all of the movies like a hundred times. Dollar Tree has a good selection of like name brand Toy Story items. So first off, I found this 48 piece Toy Story puzzle, um, perfect for his age range. This actually says six and up. Jameson's like three, he's gonna be four, and he can do a puzzle like this with the help of one of us. So I thought it was really cute, and it's got this cute little scene with Buzz, and uh, there it is in the background right there. So that would be like a fun little puzzle for him to do. Um, also, I found this velvet poster set. It's the Toy Story Color Your Own Velvet Poster. There's eight velvet posters in there, um, and it comes with a couple of markers, but you can use your own markers too that you have. I think there's just some basic color markers in there. But for a dollar, not bad. You're getting, you're getting a lot of bang for your buck on this one. And again, name brand, Toy Story 4. You know, all of the characters are in there. So another really nice item to add to your little Toy Story gift basket. That is actually something that I got from Dollar General. Um, I love checking out both Dollar Store and Dollar General um, because they Dollar General has some really good inexpensive things also. Um, I found this. This is actually a puffy sticker coloring and activity playset. It was $3, but I think it's totally worth it. Really, really cute puffy stickers. You're also getting a lot of stuff included with it. You're getting um, the puffy sticker sheet, the color an activity book and then a scene that you can put your stickers on. Jameson is gonna love this. He's all about stickers. So, and I think, I'm pretty sure that you can um, reuse the stickers on this scene because it's got like that like smooth surface that the stickers can peel off of easily. So I'm gonna add that to his little gift um, set. Then back to Dollar Tree, um, color forms. When I saw this, it like brought back my childhood. I loved color forms. And this is just, they had Toy Story color forms in the little packet. And again, if you don't remember what color forms are, they're like the little plastic stickers that aren't really stickers, but they'll stick on like a, a background. They also stick on your refrigerator and come right off. I used to love them. Me and my sisters used to play color forms all the time. So for a dollar, this is a super, super buy from Dollar Tree. So they had a few different ones. Um, I think they had Frozen. They also had, um, I think a Cars one, but I was really super happy that they had the Toy Story, so I did grab that one. They also had a Paint Your Own Artboard set, which has all the little paints in it, the paintbrush. Yeah, it's it's like a nice little hard board. It's not just like a piece of paper. So he, could, he or she could paint that and you know save it. So I thought that was really cute for a dollar. Um, I found Buzz and Woody mini figurines from Dollar Tree. How cute are those? Jameson will love these. He's all about it, all about it. And when I saw them, these are perfect. You know what else these would be perfect on? is a birthday cake. If you have a, birth, a child with a birthday coming up and they love Toy Story and they wanna do a Toy Story themed birthday, put these on their cake. 
I'm all about doing it myself. I was gonna go order him a cake this year and have somebody else make it, and I went to the grocery store and they wanted like $40 for a small cake that had like little plastic figures on them like this. And I was like, I can make something so much better than that. So this year for Jameson's birthday, I'm actually gonna do a two-tiered cake. I'm gonna do a top actual small cake with a dinosaur, because he wants a dinosaur party. And then I'm gonna do cupcakes all around the bottom and each one is gonna have a little plastic dinosaur on it so that everyone gets to have a little dinosaur with their cake. I know sometimes when there's like the toys on tops of cakes, you know, all the kids want them. So now all the kids can have one on their own little mini cup. You could put these together in a little basket and give them as a complete gift at Christmas time for a child or a grandchild. That is kind of my haul from my the Dollar Tree and Dollar General. I also want to show you the things that I saved from last year that I got on sale and what I'm going to be doing with them this year with our Elf on the Shelf. So I store everything in these big tubs. I have storage down in my basement. I packed these up last year. I actually kind of forgot about them, but when I was going through all my Christmas decorations and stuff this year, I was like, oh, there's that tub. Now I can like pull out my Elf and we can do Elf on the Shelf and all that. So we have the elf on the shelf. Obviously, I keep them right, keep them right in the storage bin with my little gift giving ideas for that year. And um, they, this elf came in a nice little book. I'm gonna see if I can link this. I bought this one from Amazon. Um, I know. Target has them, Walmart has them, but I think I got the best price on Amazon, so if I can find a link for it, I will link the elf on the shelf that we have right here. I like the book in the container because you can store the book and the dolls right in the little package. Now we have Jameson's little elf, which he's always hugging Alyssa's elf. <laughs> they always hug each other. And so we've got two of them, but it has the book with it. It's got the little plastic storage container, so I keep everything kind of you know, together when until it's time for our little elf to come and visit us. Okay, so other things that I had bought last year after the holidays, I think it was 80% off from Target Dollar Spot. I found these little foam kits right here. Now I've seen these multiple years, but last year I saw them after the holidays and I was like, you know what, I'm going to get some for this, like for the next coming year. So I picked up a few of them. I want to say they were like $5 each normally and I think I ended up getting 80% off. So I think they were like less than a dollar, like 75 cents each when I bought them. Something like that. They might have even been cheaper than that. Um, but I, I bought a few of them. This one is a little foam um, scene right here. It's got, um, I don't know, it's just really, really cute. All the little winter friends skating. I thought this was so cute, this little winter chalet and they're skiing down the roof. That'd be another fun one to put together. I found at the end of the year this little Happy Holidays Mickey and Minnie puzzle. A little bit older than what Jameson would probably do, but Alyssa loves puzzles also. I know a lot of times we will use this coffee table right here, clear it off around Christmas time and like do puzzles out here and just kind of keep them, keep them there and like work on them like throughout the holiday season. So I thought this would be a fun one to do. And again, I got this at Target last year at a really good price. I don't remember what it was, but I want to say it was probably a couple of dollars what I ended up paying for. We're going to do that from the Elf one day. Um, how many of you remember Shrinky Dinks? Do you guys remember Shrinky Dinks? Like the color forms, Shrinky Dinks, when I was a kid, were so popular. Well, these aren't Shrinky Dinks brand, but they're pretty much the same thing. They're called Shrink Art. They came from Target Dollar Spot. Um, there are a couple different scenes that you can color and then you can pop them in the oven and bake them and they get smaller and you can use them as little like Christmas ornaments. Um, but these will be really fun for the kids to do and another really cool prize or another really cool gift for your elf to bring um, at the holidays. So these were $3 normally. Again, I think they were like 80% off when I bought them. So I only paid like 25 or 30 cents, something like that for each one. Um, so definitely check out your holiday dollar section um, or the dollar spot at your Target because very often they have some good stuff after the, you know, after the holiday. I'm sure you guys have all seen these at your Target. They had them last year. They're those little um, squeezable um, snowball throwers and they like, you squeeze them 
and the little nose or the little mouth pops out. My kids loved them. We actually had some last year um, during the holidays when our whole family was here and we had like indoor fights with them. Oh. <laughs> you squeeze them and they just like pop the little ball out. I bought these last year. They played with them for a little while, but I packaged them back up. So these will be something that Jameson hasn't seen all year, even though they're not brand new. We did use them last year. He probably forgot we even had them. So the elf will bring them again this year for him to play with this year. This is another thing. I buy Jameson these little felt sets from the Target Dollar Spot. I buy, they have them all different seasons. He has a bunch of different ones, but this little gingerbread house one was really cute. I saw it last year, it's $3. Again, I got it like 80% off, something like that. And it has um, the little gingerbread house that opens up and it's got all the little felts. If I can show you, they're kind of, there's a little pocket on the back, but there's all the little candy felts that can you can decorate the candy house with or the gingerbread house with. He loves them, so another really cute idea to have for my RL. So these were also from Target Dollar Spot. I think I bought them last year. I went to open them up and I didn't end up using them last year, so I put them away. So I actually don't have the full packaging here to show you like what the, the packaging looks like. However, there's these there are these little like forest animal popsicle stick puppets. And again, it came from Target Dollar Spot last year, so we're gonna, you know, use these. It'll be a fun little craft for Jameson to do this year. And I thought this was, I actually bought this at the same time as I bought the little um, popsicle stick puppets. This would be kind of like a cute little background if for like a little mini puppet show. Again, these are the spritz. Um, this was not in the Target Dollar Spot. It was actually over in like the arts and crafts section at Target last year, and it was after the season so I found these and I think normally they were like five dollars but I think I ended up getting them like for a dollar something like that but I thought it would work perfectly with those little popsicle stick um, puppets and it's just a cute little background with these little animal and I thank you guys for watching make sure you subscribe to my channel turn on that little notification bell so you're notified whenever I post a new video we'll see you again very soon have a great day